What's going on guys, my name's Connor, and today I have a review for you guys on the Louis Vuitton Eclipse Pocket Organizer. I'm going to be breaking down all the details of this wallet, as well as going on everything it's good to purchase or not. So if you guys do enjoy these kind of videos, make sure you hit the like and subscribe button, as it really, really does help out my channel, guys, and videos showing more people. And while you're at it, make sure you claim your four free stocks on Weevil, I click the link below. All you got to do is sign up, you get two stocks for free, and another two after your first deposit. So without further ado, let's get right into the review. All right, guys, so just before I take it out of the box, I just want to go over a couple things. First off, being the retail cost. If you guys want to go onto the site right now, this item is currently still there and it is in stock for $390 USD. Obviously, you got to factor in tax and shipping as well, but if you guys go into the store, it should be available there and you guys obviously won't have to worry about shipping. And this wallet is actually only holding its value very, very well. As if you look on StockX, a lot of the recent sales are between $375 and $450 USD. So if you guys purchase it, change your mind. You guys will have no issue getting your money back even if it's past the 14 day return policy so you don't even worry as long as you guys are interested in this wallet you guys are willing to take care of it you guys should not lose very much money at all so here's a quick look at the box i'll try to get in the lighting so you guys can see it a little bit better obviously louis vuitton a little blue handle hanging out right there you guys can see right here really nothing too special about the box but i'll just pop it open for you guys real quick and boom, we got the dust bag right here. So obviously this is gonna have the sand color um, dust bag right here. I'll just take it out for you guys real quick. And then the Louis Vuitton on it should be in a very dark navy color. So for those of you guys who are new to Louis Vuitton or don't completely know how to, how to authenticate it, if it's completely black or it's a light blue, you guys know then and there that it's completely fake. But I'll just take it out of the dust bag for you guys real quick. And you guys will have the wallet right here. So just a few details that I wanna go over about this wallet. Obviously it's gonna be the Eclipse monogram coated canvas right here, which you guys can see with the beautiful black and gray monogram. Uh, the inside is obviously gonna be a dark black as well. And you guys are gonna have a lot of places to store different credit cards, wallets, and papers, which I will go over. But the dimensions of this wallet, it's gonna be about three inches um, in length. It's gonna be about four and a half inches tall. And then as far as it's like thickness right here, it's gonna be about half an inch to an inch, depending on how much you guys are holding. But when you guys open this up, you guys can clearly see that there's a lot of room for um, holding a lot of different things. Um, I'll pop these out because they give them to you like this in the store when you guys buy it straight from the store. Um, but this is just the little card right here which will go over the materials. Uh, sorry, this side is not in English, but this side is, you guys can see. Coated fabric, cowhide leather lining. I'll set that to the side really quickly and show you guys the other sticker. So this one is gonna be the one that they usually put on the box sometimes or they'll throw it in the package, but you guys can see this is what they call the item. You can see Eclipse at the end right there. And here is the item number as well as the barcode, um, M61696. If you guys wanna go into the website or go into the store and just share this item number, they will, they will know exactly what you guys are talking about. I'll set that to the side really quickly so I can show you guys the wallet specifically. So I just went over the measurements and I just went over what coated canvas it is, but the lining as said on the car is gonna be made of cowhide leather. And then it's gonna have five interior pockets as you guys can see. One, two, three, four, five. If you guys are able to see that right there. And then you guys are gonna have a little heat stamp right here, Louis Vuitton Paris made in Spain. And then on the inside, it's a little bit hard with one hand, but it should be up here or on this side. You guys will have the date code right there. So a lot of you guys look, like looking at the heat stamp and the date code to authenticate it. That is where you guys are gonna to wanna to look. And so five interior pockets as well as one exterior pocket, which you guys are able to see right here. So this is probably where you're gonna to wanna to store your ID and stuff just so you can pull it out super quickly. And then here you're gonna have your credit cards, debit cards, maybe a little bit of cash, maybe um, some receipts, especially on this side. That's what I plan on using this for. And there's gonna be a total of three credit card slots. So you guys can see that right there. And in each one, you guys should be able to hold two to three cards max. Three cards is definitely a stretch. Um, so I don't recommend doing it. I would say one to two cards max in each slot. Um, and that is just because obviously you guys should know that when you guys put credit cards or too much into these slots, they do stretch out. And so when you guys go from three cards in one slot to one, um, they might be slipping out, especially if you guys flip this upside down. But the reference is obviously made in Spain in here, but the reference can be made in France, Spain, Italy, or the US. So just a dead giveaway right there. If you guys see that it was made in um, 
Canada, Mexico, China, or any of that, you guys know then and there that it is a fake and you guys don't need to look any further. And I also want to mention that this is one of my favorite wallets if I'm being completely honest. I really love the pocket organizers. I really liked the card holders, the new ones for a while that have the little zipper on the side but it is a little bit bigger and it seems like these ones are smaller and they hold the most to be honest. Um, and obviously the multiple wallets are a little bit thicker than this. And honestly, it feels like those don't even hold as much as this one. This one is a total utility wallet. It is my favorite wallet in my favorite canvas. Um, I review a lot of crazy stuff on my channel um, where there's like some crazy canvases like the Galaxy canvas, the Prism canvas and all that. But as far as this one, this one is black and gray, goes with literally everything, and it's something that a lot of people haven't seen because it, it was only so recently that they started putting out the Eclipse Canvas, so I personally love it. And if you guys go out and show this to people, chances are that no one else has the Eclipse Canvas because it is a little bit more limited than the classic monogram or Damier graphite because obviously this one has not been around for as long and it doesn't seem like they produce as many. But final verdict, I think this is a great wallet. I think as far as market, you guys are pretty much making a risk-free purchase, if that makes sense, because you guys are buying at the price that they're selling for. So obviously if you guys change your mind, or even if you guys use it a little bit and there ends up being a little bit of wear and tear on the inside, so what, you lose 50 to 100 bucks. Um, and to some people that's a lot of money, but at the same time you guys are making luxury purchases So you guys should be able to live with that But let me know what you guys think of this wallet. Do you guys love this one as much as I do? I personally think it's one of the best wallets out there that Louis Vuitton has ever put out um, Other than the exotic ones that some of you guys might prefer but as well as but as far as simplicity in a wallet This just gets the job done and so final verdict. I think it's one of my favorite wallets I think it's one of the best canvases and I think it's super functional and um I have no regrets for this purchase, but let me know what you guys think. Let me know what else you guys want to see on my channel. I'll review some of the craziest hype and design arms on YouTube. And obviously, if you guys have made it this far in the video, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe as it really does help out my channel and get my videos shown to more people. Uh, I'm going to start giving away smaller items like this to some subscribers. So make sure you subscribe and tell your friends because once I get to the point where it makes sense financially, right now I'm really not making any money off of YouTube, but once I am, I honestly just want to give it all back. But again, thank you guys so much for watching this video and I will see you guys in the next one.